it's good everybody welcome back to the halo infinite video man we got a huge update this morning and i think you guys are going to be really happy to hear what's about to happen in halo infinite today it's going to be a lot easier to level up the battle pass and progress in general we're going to talk about everything in this video and by the way uh 97 of you guys are not subscribed to the channel so you could subscribe we're on the road to 300 subscribers we're already at like 250 which is absolutely insane i really appreciate all support everybody honestly like it's been crazy and honestly we're just having fun making some halo videos so as you all know right now in halo infinite the progression is kind of bad it's not like terrible i mean the battle pass is pretty cool it just sucks because the only way to progress or i guess level up in halo infinite is to complete challenges and i think they're actually reworking the entire system this is totally a theory but i feel like that's what they're hinting towards and we'll get into everything in this video i promise i'm gonna keep it you know real short and sweet the only way to level up in halo infinite at the moment is to complete these challenges in the game which normally like if done right maybe it wouldn't be an issue but there's this rng aspect to completing the challenges and sometimes it's just really hard to get these challenges done well to combat this i think like almost a week ago they added a challenge called play one game and basically every single game you get 50 xp no matter what so like every 20 games that you complete you'll complete one level in your battle pass which is still kind of insane and now today john unishek actually oh uh, first of all i really hope i pronounce his name right but my boy john just made a huge announcement on twitter for a change that's actually happening in halo infinite later on today so this update's going to drop today he said on twitter when we made our initial change to progression which added daily play one game challenges updated weekly challenges with more xp we promised we'd monitor the data and make additional changes if needed and now it's time to follow up on that after seeing how xp was earned with these changes we noticed that players are starting their sessions with slow but i don't even feel like reading this basically he's saying that we're gonna get more xp uh for the first six matches of the day so instead of 50 xp per game for the first game you play you'll get 300 the second and third game you'll get 200 the fourth fifth and sixth game you'll get 100 xp then the seventh game you'll get 50 xp and then obviously every game after that you'll still earn 50 so basically if you play seven games every single day you can get 1250 xp total it's like a level and then like a quarter of the next level oh no man i think for right now this is kind of cool like it's a cool little bonus but it really doesn't answer the problem of the rng aspect to how the challenges work like i feel like in the game i mean there's a literal score that pops up on your screen when you kill people or when you get medals and a percentage of this score that you accumulate in the game for doing all these different things i feel like a percentage of that should go towards your xp gain at the end of the game i don't know man just an idea but i don't think people are gonna be too happy with this whole like challenge system being the only way we earn xp forever i don't know man i think this update's cool obviously it's gonna be in the game later on today so uh, i want to know what y'all think in the comments down below let me know you know drop a like subscribe if you haven't already like keep a conversation going about like all these new updates in the comments down below and i'll try to like pin the best ones the best theories on what exactly is gonna happen with this progression system in halo infinite anyways i'll catch you on the next one i'll see y'all soon for the halo infinite video peace out everybody